I guess this is the flip side of that pathway we were walking on just a little while ago. This is crazy. Who knew such amazing technology existed? Everything stops you, Turvy, and that's all you can think about? Bear in mind, the core of Rena now sits above us. Leave Here's the a healing to me! The flames will rise! Fire to the Phoenix! The flame inside me yours to be let free! You picked the wrong fight! We just gonna need all of us together! Let's go! Go for the weak point! Now I'm in the group! Ready to Not in your dreams! Inferno punch! Where are you going? Let's break it, Justin! Steel force! Raven Fire! I'm going to use all the power Ready to go! Enjoy the ground while you're down there. I can carve through! Watch this! You picked the wrong yes, fight! Yes, 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 You're mine! Demon Fist! Big Fist has got your name on him! You'll be in high demand if that's the case. What are those? They look like Xion's thorns, and with flowers, too. Not real ones, though. They're just like that flower growing out of Rena. We must be getting close to the Great Spirit now. Hey, Rinwell, what was that thing you said about how a little bit of Dana's great spirit is inside all of us? Right. That's why Dana's great spirit is so much more... diluted. Weak, even. Whether it was a choice so it didn't overpower others, or just the way it is, is anyone's guess. If that's true, then wouldn't it mean Dana's will could never form under natural conditions? Yeah, sounds like that's probably the case. So if Dana exists within all of us, then what if something occurred that brought everyone's hearts and minds together as one? That unity could potentially act as Dana's will. You mean if everybody was, like, thinking the exact same thing at the exact same time? Come on, there's no way we could pull that off. I know it's a long shot, but it might work. Let's assume that's even possible for a second. Would it even be enough to fight back against Rena's great spirit? If nothing else, it might be an option if we can't use the Rena Salma. Things are different here than on the surface. That shows how deeply we've ventured into Rena. And how close we've come to the real enemy. Shouldn't have messed with me! Yeah. 
Who's in a bright and shiny mood? Be the work of providence. Prob what now? It means destiny. I think it's a bit of an exaggeration, though. Now I'm real mad! 
Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! Step back! This one's all long! Zoogles here are putting up a real fight. That just goes to show how important this place is. Or perhaps they simply thrived freely here under such harsh conditions. I don't get it. The astral energy here is so dense. It's like trying to walk through water. I know the Great Spirit's will is in the center of Rena. But with the world in this state, the entire planet has become its body, right? So doesn't that mean we're already inside it? I would say that is horrifyingly correct. After all, the further we climb, the denser the astral energy becomes. <sighs> What's the matter, Rinwell? Are you not feeling all right? No, it's nothing like that. It just feels like the energy here is a little more intense than it was before. You mean Rena's energy? Yeah. It's like when I made contact with Dana's will in the Wedge. It's almost as though I can understand what Rena's will is thinking. But Rena's will is supposed to be a lot stronger. Aren't we risking the Great Spirit controlling us if we interact with it directly? I don't think we have to worry about that. Rena's will is only supposed to control true Renans, like the Helganquil. If we can discern what the Great Spirit is thinking too, we might learn something, a weakness. 
But just to be safe, let me contact it alone. Are you insane? Rinwell, you're gonna... <gasps> Rinwell! There was only meant to be one world. And your goal is to make them one. Is this fear? Rinwell? Rinwell! Are you okay? No, I'm... I'm fine. I think... What were you thinking? You could have gotten yourself killed! He's right. You had us all terrified, Rinwell. I'm sorry. I really, really am. But... but... I know now! I know how the Great Spirit thinks! I know what it wants! How it feels! Rena's Great Spirit! wants to complete the world. What's that supposed to mean? Are you saying it's trying to make something? Yes, exactly. Originally, Dana and Rena were meant to be one world. But that never happened. They've stayed separated, and the Great Spirit wants to finish the process. What do you mean, one world? How is that even possible? I don't know, but its will is clear. That's what the Great Spirit is trying to accomplish. The only problem is that since Rena's energy isn't evenly spread like Dana's, it seems like it'll vanish before that happens naturally. So it's trying to absorb Dana while it still can, so that it can force the two planets to unite. Is that what you're saying? <sighs> the Great Spirit is scared. But it's not scared the way a rational person would be. It's more raw and undiluted, like just pure fear. Like an animal acting out of instinct. Although, admittedly, an animal would be easier to communicate with. At the very least, I have my doubts that it recognizes us as sentient beings with a reason for coming here. Earth, water, fire, and wind energy exist in both worlds, but only darkness and light can be found within Rena and Dana, respectively. The Renis Alma, as far as we know, the only host capable of harvesting the astral energy, is composed of all six. Knowing all that, Rinwell's findings do sound plausible. That sounds a lot like Xion's thorns, doesn't it? The whole reason the Great Spirit is trying to unite Dana and Rena into one world is in order to save itself. And if her thorns are part of the Great Spirit, then they must also be trying to save themselves? Alfin, what is it? We thought the only way to free your thorns was for you to die. Yet despite that, they seem to be doing everything in their power to stop that from happening to you. Something wasn't adding up. But then I just realized something. If the Great Spirit doesn't want to die, then neither would your thorns. Those same emotions, that fear, that determination, and its energy must have been the same thing that was keeping you alive. You were its vessel. In that case, is that why her thorns caused so much pain to anyone who touched her? Because they were trying to protect themselves? If that's all true, then... Well, it's more than a little ironic. The Great Spirit merely expresses its desires. I imagine it was the Helganquil who were likely tasked with putting together and implementing an actual plan. Xion... I'm okay. We need to hurry and clean this mess up before it gets out of hand. Still, even if the current state of the world is wrong like you said, does that really make everything okay? If the world had been whole from the start, as it should have been. There'd be no Dana and no Rena, no masters or slaves. 
No lords, no crown contest. Maybe just peace. I sure wouldn't want to live here with all of this around. I know what you mean. There are no fish here. I couldn't cook any of my delicious dinners for you all if we... ...lived here. <laughs> Clearly the worst point against it. Here's a 
You'll be in high demand if that's the case. I won't forgive you! Megasonic Thrust! Ignite! Wait, there you go! You're mine! Sword right now! Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! Lady Fortune must truly be watching over me. Sure did. The part where you swung and missed, right? Not that part! No backing down! Water! Right yeah, water. Yeah. Yeah. That freaking does it! I'm going to be fighting all the time! Here I come! Demon Pang! Try this! Far enough! I'll be back In a bind? Now I need to win! Scattering the PC again! Now you see what I can do! Breeze laser! Arch Steel! This one's mine! Come on, a lot of good things come to an end! Megasonic Thrust! Lightning Arch! Illuminate the flame inside me! Yours to be let free! Here I come! Demon Pang! Holy Land! Holy Land! Explosive Rain! Between Heaven and Earth! There you go! Don't let up! Now or never! Get no further! Get to the fray! The water is at the end! Mega Blast! Ready to go! Ready to go! Denied! So time to I'll burn out! Here I come! Not today! I look like you got this one covered! These fists have got your name on them! Explosive ring! Raising flame! That'll bring you down! It's time! In here! In a bind! Hold it forward! charge like that could easily be fatal! Just as well, I'm here to stop! I'll crush you! Lightning reflexes! Tenebrous claw! You see what happened there as you crossed me. Shouldn't have done it. Commander of Heaven! Phoenix Sopra! Hey, anyone else think this might be a touch too deep? So those thorns of Xion's, they're really a part of Rena's great spirit? Most likely, but only a small fragment of it in the big picture. 
I don't sense a will of its own emanating. 